In April 2018, The Sopranos alum got real with her Instagram fans about her multiple sclerosis diagnosis, and how it's affected breastfeeding newborn son Jack. All my fellow mommies that deal with MS or anything that causes them to have to make choices they didn't necessarily want to, this is for you. I'm having to stop breastfeeding soon so I can get back on meds, Sigler wrote. The truth is, the toll of two kids and a newborn lifestyle is not the easiest on me, and I need some help. She lamented, what sucks is that I live with a disease that makes decisions for me a lot, and with breastfeeding I took such pride that I was able to do something really awesome with this body that I am constantly at war with. The wife of actor Aaron Paul got real about life after childbirth, sharing her breastfeeding struggles on her Instagram, this post-labor chapter has been rough at times. Recovering from labor is no joke, wrote Lauren. I'm definitely on the mend in that department but breastfeeding. Oh man, she continued. While it's been one of the most beautiful experiences of my life, I have developed mastitis twice within three weeks. For those of you who don't know what that is, it's an infection from breastfeeding that creates severe flu-like symptoms. Lauren explained. Yesterday I was fighting a fever that almost hit 104. It was the sickest I have ever felt. The pain and aches were unbelievable, for the mamas who have been there, I know you feel me, having to nurse your child can be totally impromptu, as the honest company founder proved during a day of shopping, Alba's trip to Target was interrupted when the actress had to stop and breastfeed son Hayes in the store's dressing room, breastfeeding in a Target dressing room. Alba wrote on the photo, which she posted on her Instagram story, she also pointed to her face, writing, tired eyes. Malin, who recently welcomed her second child, son Laszlo, with husband Jason Biggs, shared that she was feeling rejected by her newborn, whose desire to breastfeeding seems to be waning. As of this weekend, Lass has decided, one feeding, he'll breastfeed, and then the next feeding he's just like, F that, give me a bottle, she wrote on Instagram. I feel like, he likes his milk like he likes his women, easy, with big nipples, she joked. I don't know anybody who has bigger nipples than I do right now except a bottle. I'm so pissed. I'm really sad. I'm really effing bummed. The mom of one is still breastfeeding her daughter. And although she confesses, I don't know how long I'm going to make it, there is a big pro for her in continuing for the time being. I barely had any pain when I started, and I always had a great supply, she shared in her fit pregnancy and baby cover story. Every time I breastfeed Molly, I'm famished afterward. I feel it's like a workout. I'm afraid when I stop breastfeeding, I'm going to gain a bunch of weight. All that gnawing at your nipples will take its toll, PR. My nipples were huge, we are talking the size of frisbees, and sometimes I could see these veins bulging out while I was nursing, she shared. My boobs themselves were so long and stretchy that I sometimes felt like I could have swung them over my shoulders. I could last only about an hour because my boobs were exploding, Blunt explained to InStyle, recounting a dinner date with husband John Krasinski a week after welcoming their second daughter, Violet. When the milk first comes in, it's like a tsunami. We went, just to prove to ourselves that we could feel normal for a second. There were many times where I read not bring a cover with me, and so I just did it in a restaurant, in the subway, in the park, at airports and in planes. Why did I do it in public? Because I had to feed my child. She's hungry, the bad mom's actress told Vanity Fair of having to endure judgmental stares while breastfeeding her daughter Wyatt Isabel in public. It took us a little bit because people actually looked at us in a shameful way, and we were like, oh my god, because it's so not a sexual act. There are many, air, perks to breastfeeding, as the former Laguna Beach star was quick to address on Instagram. I just want to thank breastfeeding for making my left boob perkier than my right, she wrote, commenting on her cleavage-bearing Grammys look. When it came time to star in husband Dax Shepard's movie Chips, the actress made the decision to forego breast pumping for the sake of her on-screen character, which proved to be Belle's physical sacrifice while filming her scene in the movie. I was like, my craft deserves it. I gotta do it. I'm a serious actor, Belle told Seth Meyers during an appearance on Late Night. I was breastfeeding at the time. I wanted my character to have an aggressive boob job, like it's the only thing you can think about when you see someone, so I didn't pump for a full day, explained the Veronica Mars alum. And I said to the kids, Daddy's making a movie, go to the fridge, the food truck is closed, edit post.